Here's a Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5. I'm going to show you how to insert a physical SIM card and then double check the mobile settings, okay? So first thing you got to do is take out this SIM tray here. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and open the phone up like this and then it's on the left hand side okay so you can see the outline of the SIM tray here you see that little hole right there you want to put your SIM ejection tool in there SIM ejection tool looks something like these here it does come out of your box I guess in this pamphlet yep right there but if you don't have that laying around you can use another SIM ejection tool from a different uh, phone or tablet or iPhone iPad or whatnot so let me go and grab this needle here left hand side I see that hole right there I'm gonna go ahead and put the insert the needle into that hole and then what I'm gonna do is once the needle is in there now I'm gonna to press towards the phone and now you see that lip pops out a little tiny bit right there so let's go ahead and pull this out I'm gonna pull this out and I'm gonna leave it just like this okay I'm not gonna turn it over or nothing so I know exactly the way it goes back in okay so if I hold it this way here there's a diagonal slit on the top right hand side so if you look at your SIM card, you should be able to match it, okay? You can't get this wrong, okay? And, okay, I can only put it, the, the metal is going to be on the bottom. The metal part is going to be on the bottom here, it looks like. So we're going to put it just like that. Kind of snaps in place too, okay? So it's nice and flush. Now when I turn it over, it should not fall out, okay? So now, Right now it says no SIM, no service. Let's put this in now nice and slowly and see what happens here. Okay, make sure it's all the way pressed in here. Oh, it says searching, okay, looks like it's registering now. Okay, so I just saw a voicemail just came through. Anyway, another thing is too, if you guys are using a T-Mobile carrier uh, in the US, once you insert the SIM card, it may ask you to restart the phone, okay? Anyway, so it looks like I'm up here. Let me go ahead and go to the settings, so the mobile settings here. So let me slide up here. We're going to go to settings. And then from here, we're going to go to uh, make sure to tap on connections here. And then tap on mobile networks. And you can see uh, by default, they turn my data roaming on, which is fine. Uh, network operators select automatically. So that's all good for me. Now, you also have uh, this too. Okay, let me let me go back here. Under connections here, you also have SIM Manager. Uh, let me tap on SIM Manager here, and let me hide my phone number here, okay? But the first one is a SIM one where it's in, okay? Now, if I wanted to add a eSIM, download eSIM, I can do that as well down here, okay? That's if you have that, all right? Anyway, I'm up and running. There you go. Questions, issues, comment below.